inviting a couple of you to come and join me. Got a bit of a quick unboxing for you this evening. Ooh, my camera's falling. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> So I have a quick unboxing for you this evening, as I've just said, it's Secret Scent, uh, which is here. Um, it's a little letterbox sized um, box, so you don't have to be in to receive it. Uh, it's a monthly fragrance subscription, um, so it helps you to discover three new designer perfumes or aftershaves every month. Um, hi Natasha. Uh, and you get a 30 day supply of each fragrance so it's plenty of time for you to try them out um, and kind of get a feel for them make sure it's something that you do like before you decide to purchase a full size if you do want to so I'm going to get into the box so the first thing we get is the theme card which is obviously for June so it's nice and tropical with palm trees and a nice sunset on there and then you have the cards, the fragrance cards themselves, which explain in a little bit more detail about each of the fragrances that are included. And there's also a share and win an Amazon gift card uh, card, which is always in every single month. Uh, and all you have to do is uh, take a photo of your box and post it on Twitter, Facebook, or Instagram with the hashtag Secret Scent Box, and you could win a £25 Amazon gift card. So I'll just pop that to the side. And then if I just show you here, that's how the little fragrances look. So it's in like, kind of like a spongy velvet foam type material to keep the actual vials themselves safe. I think they're plastic, um, but it's always nice to know that they're not gonna get damaged in transit. So what I'll do first is I'll just get the first one out, which is Burberry and it's Touch for Women. So you always find that the fragrance cards correspond to the bottles, so they're both green. Uh, and what the fragrance card also does is it shows you a photograph of the full size bottle. So then if you do like, um, you like what you, when you try it, you know kind of what you're looking for if you do, did want to go out and purchase the full size. What it also does is gives you some of the fragrance notes that are in it so that you can look for fragrances that have similar ingredients in them as well. So this one says it's a luminous, fruity and floral fragrance with a serene and delicate nature. Touch represents the intimacy and sensuality of modern relationships. So it has top notes of blackcurrant, dewberry and pink peppercorn. It has middle notes of jasmine, lily, peach, raspberry and tuberose. And base notes of cedarwood, oak moss and vanilla. So let's have a quick sniff. Oh, I like that. That's really fruity. You could definitely smell the blackcurrant in that. And it says vanilla on there. Vanilla is one of my favourite fragrance notes. Um, I'm more of a kind of a fruity or a musky kind of girl rather than a floral, uh, mainly because I have hay fever. Um, so floral ones tend to kind of set me off on a bit of a sneezing fit. So that one definitely kind of fits the bill for the sort of fragrance that I usually like. The next one, and I can get it out of the little box, there we go, is Calvin Klein Eternity Summer. And this one says it's a brand new fragrance inspired by a beautiful summer sunset. Eternity Summer evokes the alluring romance of the season in this sensual scent. And it has top notes of rose, bergamot and violet leaf. Middle notes of ginger, jasmine, sandbag and coconut nectar. And base notes of musk, vetiver and guaiac wood. I think that's what it says. Forgive my pronunciation there, but let's have a quick sniff of this one. Okay. So that's quite floral, I can definitely smell the rose in that on first sniff, however I can see that that would probably die down to be quite a musky scent, which is something that I do like. So even though the initial scent of floral is probably not my favourite, it probably will die down to something that will smell quite nice, or at least in, in my opinion anyway, obviously I know scent is very very subjective. And then the last one, again, I'm trying to get it out, there we go, is Vera Wang and it's Flower Princess uh, and it says one of our favourites from Vera Wang, an enchanting fragrance experience that radiates freshness, capturing the warmth of sunlit flowers in bloom. So it has top notes of ivy, water lily and tangerine, middle notes of jasmine, orange blossom, mimosa and rose 
and the base notes of amber, musk, apricot and precious woods. So let's have a sniff of this one. So that, again, really fruity, really citrusy on first scent, which obviously is probably from the tangerine and the, the orange blossom, which is not normally a scent that I like, but that's actually quite nice. And again, I can tell that that would probably die down to quite a musky sort of scent as well. Um, so yeah, three scents that I probably uh, would say I would, I would enjoy um, smelling. And that won't set me off you usually can tell straight away it'll set me off sneezing if it's going to make me sneeze so what i'll quickly do then is i'll just run through the prices with you so um they do a women's and a men's subscription option both of them are priced in exactly the same way um so it's 15 pounds per month uh, or you can prepay for six months and that's 84 pounds or you can prepay for 12 months which is 156 um and they all come with free delivery and obviously it's small enough to fit through a letterbox as well so you don't have to be in to receive it it does come in an outer cardboard box as well just to protect this uh, which i've already thrown away so um we do have a discount code as well which is box session 50 and that gets you your first box for half price and um, they only ever use 100 percent authentic fragrances and um, so you can be rest assured that you're not going to get any fakes that you're going to have any kind of reaction to obviously with fakes there can be anything in there um, but these are, are genuine authentic so oh. <laughs> apologize about that my camera doesn't appear to want to play ball with me today there we go so um yeah that's all of the fragrances just kind of hold it here for you um and i'll quickly just show you the little box again so it comes in a really cute little um little box I like to use this to kind of store jewellery and things afterwards as well. I think it's kind of too cute to throw away really. Although I do have a lot of them building up now. Um, so I'll quickly show you what they all were again. So we had the Burberry Touch um, for women. There was the Calvin Klein Eternity Summer, which obviously we're in summer right now, although you wouldn't know it from the rain we've had the last few days, at least up in Yorkshire. And fi uh, finally, Vera Wang Flower Princess. So that's all three of the fragrances this month. And again, um, my review will be out in about a week's time once I've kind of had a chance to smell them all properly, try them all out properly. Um, and again, scent is very subjective. So what I think is, is nice, somebody else might not. Um, and that's totally up to you. And that's why this sort of subscription is really handy to help you kind of try things out before you buy them because we don't always know if we're going to like something um, and sometimes you find when you go to these department stores or these perfume stores you can sometimes get a bit of a headache after sniffing one or two of the perfumes and then you don't really get an accurate representation you can go a bit nose blind so that this way you've got 30 days to try them risk free so again that's box session 50 to get your first box for half price and i will see you all tomorrow have an un another unboxing for you all tomorrow um but until then see you all soon bye